Yo, welcome back to Dang and Rumpa, and we're in chapter two. In the last episode, we found out that Togami was talking bullshit in the library, and now we're here in our room again. Another day gone. But even though today is over, this game definitely isn't. How long is this game gonna keep going? Who knows? Probably until everyone's dead. All the stress and anxiety kept me from falling asleep until late in the night. Hey, <laughs> relatable. Monokuma Theater! My favorite time of the day. That's the reason I got insomnia. Whenever I spot a cute girl, I have a tendency to stare. I can't help it, I just gaze with intensity. Oh, also, because I was listening to a nostalgia playlist uh, last night on my Discord server. And... You know the song, You're Beautiful by James Blunt? If you Now, if you watch the videos of Rumi Official, you already know where this is going. But did you know the song is actually about stalking? Because after I watched that video, I was paying attention to the lyrics and... She's literally saying about she didn't know I was so high. <laughs> That's kind of funny to me. The other day, I rode my bike to the train station. I was in the bathroom, just looking at myself in the mirror. That's what you do when you see a mirror, you look at yourself, because there's literally no... Nothing else you can see in there. Kind of creepy if you think about it like that. Good morning! Right. Good morning, everyone! Right. It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is it's officially, officially over. over. Time to, to rise, rise and, and shine. shine! Get ready to greet another beautiful day! Okay, Monokuma, if that's what you say. Well, I guess I'd better head to the dining hall before anything else. And that's. How does what? this work again? Okay. Not like that, obviously. I'm so out of the controls. Oh, right. Let me go out of here. I'm gonna spin dash to the cafeteria. I forgot how to run. Okay, I know how to run. I cannot control the run. The speed is in me, but the speed is controlling me. I cannot control the speed. I went to the breakfast meeting, same as always, but someone missing. Kyoko isn't here. Is this everyone? She's a little small. Oh, also, one of my friends on Instagram has made a post that Ishimaru's English voice actor is the same as Deluxe from Genshin. I didn't know. I didn't know the depth to this game, but I'm gonna pay attention to that in the next class trial. If he makes it to the next class trial. <laughs> Would be a shame if not. Now that I know this fact. Even though I don't like Deluxe. Yaku and Toko had stormed off yesterday, and it wasn't too surprising they hadn't come today. Uh, even the table looks bigger, somehow. <sighs> I assume that is because three people are dead and two are abstaining. Yeah, oh yeah, true. Yeah, with five people missing, I guess it would feel kinda empty. Hmm. Still, I know Yaku is whatever, but shouldn't we go check on Toko? For serious? I won't know. She's super annoying. <laughs> you know, she could be dead. How can you be so cold? You're like a piece of rock candy. Rock candy. I would not eat rock candy. That does not sound edible at all. You hear me? What? No, rock candy isn't cold. It's sweet. What is rock candy? Am I the only one missing out on something? That's an American Shit. thing. Anyway, Yaku is the real problem. If we don't keep an eye on him, he might really kill someone. You can see it in his eyes. <laughs> What's he gonna do? Throw a book on him? We got no choice. Get some rope. We're gonna have to keep him bound and gagged. That's going a little overboard. He's right. In this situation, it's nothing scarier than, what it, than when an ally turns tur turns loose cannon. It's just like when we were kids and someone would do crazy at sports day or whatever. What? What the fuck are you talking about? You're gonna use the rope to do a tug of war or something, idiot? Literally, what is going on with both of them? It can't be. I'm not an idiot. Yo! You're an idiot. Okay. Interesting. Damn you. Or are you calling stupid? Oh, <laughs> huh? What's wrong, Shiro? You don't look so great. Oh, I'm just going through a little self-loathing. Same. I feel you. Huh? Self-loathing. Well, whatever Byaku said to me yesterday, I just got so nervous. I locked up and I couldn't say anything. Well, now if your yesterday wouldn't have been like two months ago for me, then I would know what you were saying. 
Mondo ended up having to help me out and I even... He said... I can't read when there's a bottle in front of my screen. He said I was someone who can't fight back. Aww. I... I hate how weak I am. Ah, uh, I see. So Mondo made you depressed. What if Shihiro is gonna work out with Sakura? I think Sakura would be a great sensor. What? 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 Oh. How is it my fault? Hey, come on. I wasn't trying to be mean. Besides, girls are just naturally weak anyways, right? That's wrong. Did you look at Sakura? Literally. <laughs> Don't make her cry. Yeah. Uh, are, are you crying? Congratulations, Mondo. You're officially a Chad. <laughs> That's because you were screaming like a lunatic. <laughs> Hey, come on. Don't cry. It's my fault, okay? I won't yell at you anymore. Hmm. Really? I'm not sure I can believe that. Huh? Uh, just shut up. What? Got it. I'll make what? you promise as a man. Huh? Promise as a man? Yeah, that's right. Maybe I mentioned this before, but... Ever since I was a kid, there was one thing my brother told me over and over again. He said that no matter what, a real man always keeps his promises. That's what he left me. Oh. Left you? Yeah. Uh, yeah. My brother's dead. Oh, I see. That's true. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. Don't want to make all you guys cry. Maybe he's got a good spot in his heart somewhere. Yo. Anyways, you can trust me when I make that promise. So you don't go to cry anymore. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Mondo. That's really sweet, actually. Oh my god. Oh. oh. He's blushing. Sure. But... But I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get stronger. If I'm so weak, anything can make me cry. That's not good. So don't stress out too much about having to get stronger. Um, no, I want to get stronger. Maybe I should start working out. <laughs> In that case, I will be able to help you out anytime. That's what I told you. I knew she was here. But, but then Miss Fujisaki would get smashed into a billion pieces. <laughs> imagine, imagine Shihiro being tiny like this, people being buff like this, like buff Natsuki from Doki Doki Literature Club. Just a second. Just shut up. <laughs> Aww. You know? <laughs> oh, finally cracked a smile, huh? I see. Yeah. Thank you. Everyone, thank you. Looks like Shihiro's gotten some life back. <laughs> I just misread Shihiro as Chihuahua. <laughs> and that's very fitting, they look the same. Yeah, man, if we keep helping each other out like this, we're bound to get out of this crappy place sooner or later. I mean, someday, I'm sure. Is my face cam setting right? I don't... I don't know. Sorry if it's weird angled. Still, our biggest concern right now... Wait. Gotta, gotta sit like this. It's the other two who never showed up to breakfast. What can I do to try to understand to these two better? Maybe go to their rooms. Okay, so what should I do today? Let's look for Toko. If, oh wait, if this is part of a main story, we probably can't find her even in the hangout event. Um, where is Chihiro's room? Wanna work out with me? Wanna work out with me? It's Chihiro's room, I don't have anything I need to talk to her about right now. You're telling me this is my free time. I can talk to whoever I want. See, here's what I have anything I need to talk to him about right now. I, this is my free time! Shut up! Where's Toko's room? Is she in there? I'm stuck. In the wall, okay. Leon. And this is Leon, he's dead. I don't have anything to talk to him. Uh. Door won't budge, it must be locked. Wow, what a surprise! Sakura, Aoi, Celeste. I can't open any door, right? Anything I need to talk to her about right now. What if I want to talk to people? What if I want? I guess I should press the doorbell. Oh! Okay, didn't expect this to work. I thought this was my free time and this was part of the main story. Leave me alone. You don't have to pay attention to me. Mm, to hang out with Toko for a while? Literally, we can hang out with her, even though she's like not even supposed to be here, okay? I don't care. <laughs> uh, just do whatever you want. She clearly said, leave me alone, and now I'm like, I want to talk to you. Uh, hi. 
I don't care about anything you say. Spend some time with Toko. Oh, what is that face? Toko and I grew a little closer today. What did you guys do that she gives you this look? What kind of closer? Would you like to give Toko a present? Yeah, why not? I'm sure we got some trash we can give her. Roasted tea, sea salt, prismatic heart attack. Love statues ring. You want to marry me? Max gloves. Oh, I could have given the gloves to Chihiro. Red scarf, leaf covering. Team's DK t-shirt, Empyro's phone. Demon Angel Princess figure. Let me scroll. Self-destructing cassette. Azura's tears. Tips and tips. Water flute. Small light. I thought I gave the flashlight to Kyoko. School crest. Despair bed. Well, the people I could have given these to are already dead. Uh. Um. Yo, Toko. Do you, um. I don't know. I don't know much about you. Do you maybe like baseball? You can you can beat me up with it for self defense. Sorry, but we can't let you give her that. It's what we in the industry like to call a key item. Oh, is that the thing we got from Leon? <laughs> okay, what you like to give to her? Uh, some instant noodles. Long tasting cracker used by in emergency ration. Each piece contains a full seven different flavors. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> You're giving this to me? I don't think it makes me ha happy or whatever. It's more annoying than anything. Oh, she's Tsundere. Does that mean she liked it? She's just standing there. Does she want something? She's not saying anything. This moment when the mutual friend leaves and you're like stuck there with a random person being like... Cool. What's going on? I don't know. Maybe you maybe should try to start a conversation. Um, Toko? <laughs> What? You wanna to talk to me? Well, I can't stop you, so talk already! Okay, sure, but what should I say? So, uh, what do you like to do in your spare time? <laughs> Why do you wanna know? Because this is how a conversation works, Toko. Well, I mean, you know, we're trapped here together, right? If we're gonna be friends, it'd be nice to get to know each other. Uh, uh, what did you just say? Um, oh, dramatic music change. <laughs> After the part about being trapped, we're gonna be what? Uh, friends. <laughs> what do you mean for friends? You think I'm stupid? You're trying to trick me! <laughs> I've already been hurt once before. I'm not gonna let it happen again. You've been hurt? What happened? Anyway. Oh, come on, you don't really care about me. You don't want to know about me even I know that. Um, maybe I, I wouldn't be asking if I wouldn't. That's not true. <laughs> Fine, don't tell me. Tell you what? <laughs> you know why they could call me the ultimate writing prodigy, right? Because you like to write? Uh, yeah, sure, you've won all kinds of literature prizes and stuff. <laughs> to tell me what I'm good at, to tell me what my genre specialty is. Uh, romance, mystery, I don't know. If you really convince me you give a crap, you should at least know that. The genre that the ultimate writing prodigy specializes in is non fan fiction. Non -fiction. Romance! <laughs> It's romance, of course. Oh, you actually knew! Your biggest success was to linger the ocean, right? Everyone says it's your masterpiece. I wasn't sure for a second because, like, I knew it was romance, but, like, adult things would be like romance, but, like, with more explicit stuff, and she seems like a type of guy to write explicit stuff. The book was such a hit that fishermen shot to the top of all the hottest man poles, right? <laughs> How did you know all that? There's no way you could care about me. Well, I don't care about you, but I've got a functioning brain. At least my character in the game does. I don't- I don't have. I lost it when I paid it to Genshin Impact. I'm telling you, I do. I mean, we're friends, aren't we? I'm blind. Your straightforward nature blinded me. Did she just ran off? Took a ran off screaming like a banshee. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Does she hate me now? Toko's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. You just unlock the school vocabulary. You give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Thank you, man. Thanks. Ow. I don't know what I'm doing here. Once you were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. Can't talk to another person? 
I want to give the boxing, glo the boxing gloves to Chiro. There's still time left in the day. Yes. Okay, okay, let's go out again. On the road again. On the road again. Okay, there's Celestia. Someone I definitely don't want to talk to. Let's go to the gym. Let's zoom. Where do I go? If I just follow through here, it's locked and I can't go on. The gate is blocking access to the stairs. I wonder if it will open up at some point. Why are there two stairways that lead to the same place? I don't know. And neither do you. Where's Kyoko? I thought she was in the cafeteria. I'm zooming so fast. They call me cheerleader. Whoa. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, let me in. Well, let's go upstairs. Why is literally no one here? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Where are you guys hiding? Um, wait, I'm gonna find the way. It's this way, right? Right, pool. Where's the gym? Oh. No one here. Can't go there. Yo, boys, what's up? Mondo, you wanna talk to me? You wanna go training? You wanna go work out with me? Okay, wow. No, no one here. Where did they go then? That's kind of right. I wanted to leave the area, but um, exit. R. Leave the pool, yes. Where is everyone, literally? Maybe we can go to the Mono Mono Machine. At least I know where this is. I don't want to talk to Celestia, man. There's like so many other people I would rather talk to. Okay, there's another staircase. Um, let me in. So the library. The library. Biakria! Seems to be really focused on a book now, so it's not a good time to talk to him. What book is he even reading? Is it like... Something important? Did he find something out about the situation, maybe about the school? About Monokuma? I don't know. Is Kyoko still in here? I think like... Reality isn't there everything like I'm not really sure but I guess in SDR 2 they had at least like on the map that you could see where Each character was So you knew where to go to if you wanted to talk to someone, you know Why is this here? Talk to me. Oh butterflies the baby is sleeping. Please be quiet. Monokuma is so full of bullshit, but uh, that's nothing new. Um, pool. Well, I guess people must be downstairs then. That's... Where does that lead to? Is that where we came from? I don't know, actually. Have I been there before? Oh! Alright, okay, I see. I see! Cool. Okay, okay, guys, we need to make content, so... Let's go to the Mono Mono Machine. Give me some cool things! Give it a shot. Alright. Oh, cool. Oh, I'm lucky. Gimme. Well... I already have this one. Gimme more. Gimme more. Oh, is that something to eat? Was it bird food or was it underwear? I don't know. 
A brick. Cool. Very cool. Oh, cute. Now, if we only had some babies here, I could give this to. Is that a gun? Literally. Ooh. Give me. Okay, something Japanese, I guess. Another brick. It's literally, you could literally use that to kill someone. What the fuck? I got a gun, I got two bricks. I got whatever the fuck this is. Biscuit, turd, I don't know. Is that an ambush? What kind of random stuff are they giving to me? Oh. It's either a cigarette or a pencil. Cool. Oh, another butt plug, aka sea salt. Sea salt butt plug for the extra spice. Another baby, baby thing. Bodysuit. And something antique looking. And another gun. Alright. Uh, how can I. Can I leave, please? Thank you. Should probably get going. Yeah. I'm sorry, Makoto. I know, you, you're not a fan of gambling addiction. I'm sorry I, I, I made you like this. It wasn't on purpose. I, I'm so addicted to gambling, I can't even remember where I come from and where I go. Which direction is the right one? I don't know. No, there's no one here. Where the fuck are people? Literally. Okay, wrong way. Um, maybe in a gym. I really don't want to go and I want to see this place ever again. Okay. Slow down, Bakuro. People. Where are people? People. Pe Let me in. So desk I woke up when I first got here. A little pamphlet is still laying there. I have absolutely no desire to look at it ever again. Makoto, you're being such a mood wrecker. You're killing this whole let's play. It's all his fault. Absolutely. This blackbird belongs to us now. Secret beauty. Secret beauty. I wanna leave. Where are people literally? Um well done. I guess everyone's gonna be in the main place. I don't know. How can you find people? Oh, look, it's my favorite cat. No, 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 please leave me alone. Please. I absolutely don't want to talk to this guy, I'm sorry. This guy is like poor stress, I don't... I don't like he- Oh! There you are, guys! What are you doing here? What? Um... I don't wanna hang out with you. I wanna hang out! With you! Um... What's wrong? Did you need something? Mm, should I hang out with Chihiro for a while? Yes! I wanna hear more <laughs> about your story! I mean... The other guy already told his story. His brother is dead, so... If you know the ending, why ask? You wanna sit down and talk? You wanna sit down and talk for a while? Yes! Spend some time talking with Chihiro. Chihiro and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Chihiro a present? Oh, what could I give her? Um, Rose hip tea, sea salt. Mm, bird seed, love statues ring. Blueberry perfume. Got. Yo! That was right. That's what I wanted to. Why can I not give them to her? Where's oh, I unlocked them, but I don't have any of them. Uh, weird. Okay. Leaf cover. <laughs> um, it's weird that they show me these things just because I unlocked them, but even when I don't have them. 
All Time Radio, Prince, Shotokus Globe, Asura's Tears, Tips and Tips. Hints of course for every game ever released, a must have for any true gaming fan. Oh! Hey, cool. hey. Oh, it's really amazing. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> I'll take really good care of it. I'll hold onto it forever. Seeing Tiara so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. Truly, truly happy. Mm, no. What? No. What's wrong, Chiro? Um, it hurts. Did you get hurt, Chiro? You know? Uh, well, not really. I got bit by a mosquito last night. I'm gonna beat it up, a mosquito. Oh, I figured something serious had happened since you were saying how it hurt. Huh? Oh, did I give you the wrong impression? Sorry. You don't have to apologize, it was my own fault. But you said it hurts. Did it really bite you that hard? Um... Yeah, see? Look. Oh, that's disgusting! Get that shit out of my face! She held her arm. The huge red bump stood out clearly against her pale skin. Oh. Holy cow! What should I do? It's way past itchy now. It really hurts. Why well, it's so big? Did it bite you while you were sleeping or something? You're wrong. Uh, no, I was awake. Didn't notice. Like, I imagine there was like a big ass mosquito, like this big, <laughs> flying towards Shira and she just ran away screaming. Mm. No, I noticed, but... What? You know? Well, I felt it bite me and I looked down a bit. I didn't do anything, I just sat there and watched it suck my blood. This escalated and I didn't expect this. Um, I just watched, why didn't you smack it? Huh? Because I would have killed it, right? Well, yeah, but... You know? You must have been really hungry to suck that much blood. You do realize we're actually in a killing game. <laughs> if it was that hungry, it would have been really sad to not let it have anything. But it's just a mosquito. Um... Mosquitoes are living things too, though. Might have its own mosquito family. Sorry, I know that's some... It's actually kind of... Not really, you don't have to apologize. Don't go scratching it, okay? That'll just make things worse. But what if it gets so itchy I can't take it? Well, in that case, just take the tip of your fingernail and push it into the bum. That'll help. Oh, yeah, right. Actually. Huh? Wow, I had no idea. <laughs> You're so smart, Makoto. As she said that, she smelled like a tiny, cute little animal. I wonder if she does that on purpose. Aww. So that's a whole other level of scary. Oh. Mm. But anyway, don't you think it's kind of strange? Ah, uh, what is it? You know? Well, the school is completely scaled off, right? So how did mosquito get in? Maybe there's somewhere here in the school where bugs can live and grow. Some kind of nature spot. Oh! Oh, right, that's a good point. Or maybe they're like... Like before the killing game started, they laid some eggs in the food that is hidden in the kitchen and then... I'm just making things gross, I'm sorry. Nature place in the school. Can't say for sure that there's not... Or, or maybe a secret passage somewhere that leads out of the school. I mean, there's gotta be like some type of connection, like either some spot that has plants or like a spot that has like windows leading outside because we would run out of, of, of oxygen if there wasn't, I think. Is that how things work? I don't know. <laughs> secret passage. Well, even if there's not, I'm sure we get out of here somehow. As long as we all work together, I'm sure we'll be out of here in no time. <laughs> You're right, working together is super important. But... Of course, I don't know how I can be useful. I probably just weigh you all down. That's not true. It makes me feel way better knowing you're here to help. Huh? It does? Really? Yep, so let's all do our best, okay? Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Makoto. That was a wholesome conversation compared to some other conversations we had with other characters. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. Hell yeah. And now... I guess I'm feeling a little hungry. Better get something to eat before it's night time. Should head to the dining hall then, I guess. Okay, mysterious music popping up. Leave the area, yes. I wonder what's going on. Sorry, I gotta check my face cam for a sec. Alright. I don't like the atmosphere. It feels so heavy right now. Kinda weird. Just wanted to get something to eat. Now I'm about to get roped into something like this. Um, you know, I guess I'm already roped in. Listen to me. 
Hey, Makoto, perfect timing. Uh, what are you guys doing? Are you like playing to kill each other? Uh, what's going on? Hey, damn it. I have a favor to ask. A favor, I have a bad feeling about this. Hey, damn it. Come on, Makoto, you gotta be our witness. Witness? What for? Witness to what? What? This guy's been talking shit about me since day one, calling me a coward and shit like that. You're corrupt! You are a coward. That's why you turn to wild and solve your problems. Yo! That's why you can't do what society asks of you. Why you walk around dressed like that? Huh? Fuck you say. What's what's wrong with the way he dresses? I mean his hair, yeah. But the rest? Yeah. You don't know shit. You hear me? You've already lost to yourself, but you're such a coward, you don't even realize it. Damn I you. don't know how to handle this conversation. You guys sound the same when I voice you. So what you're saying, you're not a coward. Think you're tougher than me? Count on it. I know I am. You wanna fight? Okay, now let's throw down. Prove you got what I don't. You what I don't me? got. I accept your challenge. What? That's what's happening, Makoto. You gotta be your witness. You're gonna throw down. You're gonna not like start punching each other, are you? Why is this giving me Ishiro and Samatoki energy? Hey. There's a bear house on the first floor in the dorm, right? With a sound I said. I see. I see a simple endurance contest. Is it? Got it. I'm going to see you can say the song the longest am I right? Piece of shit! Goddamn straight. <laughs> That's literally Ichiro and Samatoki, what the fuck? Are you guys really gonna go through with this? Shit, yeah. Am I am I Ramuda in this situation? <laughs> because I feel like he would be there. <laughs> Ramuda be like there turning up the temperature. <laughs> You know, like in Hypnosis Microphone, they had like, I think it was like, it was from a drama track or something, because I know there's a song about it, and it's called, like, Moisa de, I don't know, but it's like, it's like a sauna quiz, where Ichiro and Sama talking were in a sauna together, basically doing the same thing, and during this, this, like, while they were rapping, they were like having to answer quiz questions, and the song was actually a bop, and this just reminds me of it. We'll be done in a matter of minutes anyway. People like him are without exception all talk. You wanna throw down? Bring it on! Ah, yeah, let's make things interesting. Wouldn't wanna win without a challenge, right? Interesting. You son of a bitch! We're gonna battle with all our clothes on! Are you guys insane? Ridiculous! I guess that's what censorship does to you. Uh, that's uh, idiotic! Suicidal! You wanna fight? What, are you afraid? No, he's just gay. He just wanted to see you naked. He just wanted to have a look at that beep beep. You're going to regret this. Stop fucking around. Shut up and let's do this. Um. Hey, Mondo. Hey, that's cheating. Why did you take off your shirt? What asshole? You can take off your uniform, you know. Go ahead. I won't judge. And okay. you can shut the fuck up and mind your own business. I mean, look at you. <laughs> Why does he have a towel on his hair? Your face is all red. What are you, one of those goddamn hot spring monkeys? There's literally flames in the background, I can't. It just so happens, I was born with a red face. Oh, that's where you got the red eyes. You don't have to act all big, man. Act, you say? <laughs> I can't I can't hear that he's voiced by D-Look. Like, Sean Chiplock was his name, I guess. Sounds so different again, Genshin, if that's really the same voice actor. <laughs> I'm still plenty good to go. I'm so good. I could eat a steaming hot bowl of soup right now! Like, I know that's what voice actors do, sounding different in every role. And I know that, like, the guy, like, Sekagular, who voices Ether in Genshin, also has a very good range and co can go really deep with his voice. But this, I don't know, Deep look sounds way deeper. Are they okay? I tried to push my concern aside. A few minutes passed, and a few dozen minutes. In an hour, did they both pass out? Did, did I just witness murder? Did they just get killed by their own stupidity? Okay, they're still here. Don't you think it's about time you gave up? I didn't even know we had a sauna, to be honest. What about you? You can't even hardly talk, dumbass. Say whatever you want. I'm still totally good to go. In fact, I'm starting to feel a Kinda cold. No, nope, you're not. Probably not good. You guys are seriously getting cold if you're gonna stay in there. Hey, uh, guys. 
I know you're both on a profile big of fat as you are, but... Did you think you've done enough? I uh, just can't win. Um... The body has been discovered! Um... <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. Time for what? Oh, time for a sleep, such, okay. <laughs> it is officially night time. <laughs> My sleeping schedule is so fucked. Okay, I actually just mistook p.m. for 10 a.m. But like 10 p.m. feels to me like 4 p.m. to be honest Soon when you're staying up to, to 7 a.m. The hall will be locked and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Guys, now get out of here or you're gonna stay the whole night okay, in there. Then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Thank you, Monokuma. Um... Hey, did you hear that? It's night time. Oh, but we call it a tie. In a true competition, there's no such thing as a tie. You win, or you lose. That's the only thing that matters. <laughs> Listen to you, you son of a bitch. Or did I confuse things in Mondo's voice, but he looks like, I don't know. But Mondo's voice sounds more familiar. And bring it on. I'll, I'll push you right up to the gates of hell. Can you can you please use that voice and say I will have order? I'm trying I'm trying to get to something, okay? Gates of hell, it's not a good place to push someone. This isn't good guys. Uh you hear him. Better crawl him back to your room. I'll let you know how it went in the morning, then you can start spreading my my legend. Come tomorrow morning! You fell down in front of me, down on your knees, I'll show you how to do it. Oh, big talk from someone whose face is about to explode. Right back at you! Okay, well, good night then. I'ma head out. I'ma head out, I said. Really hope those two don't overdo it. But I'm sure to the death. I'm not sure they wouldn't go that far. I wouldn't be too sure, actually. Did you, did you look at them? I don't think they know what's going on. The concert stayed with me. As I slowly succumb to sleep. Monokuma Theater! If fate does exist, does that mean your future is decided the moment you're born? If all your yesterdays pile up to create your tomorrow, is your future as final as your past? I just don't know. That's why I'm still alive! Because I don't know! That's why I desperately cling to life! Well, that's so deep and so beautiful, but guys, I would say we will see in the next episode what goes on if these guys are still alive. Until then, Shazam, Blam. soon.